Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today we are once again back on Red Dead Redemption 2, and I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to kill the legendary white bison. This guy is an absolute behemoth. He is a unit. He is a monster. You won't be able to miss him. He's huge, and he's out in the snow, making it a little bit easier to track him down. Uh, he's fairly easy to kill if you play your cards right. I believe it took me six shots with a rifle. So if, as long as you have dead eye, he should be very easy to take out. You won't have to do a lot of tracking. He won't be able to run away from you. And, uh, and you'll be able to get that white bison pelt sooner than later. So let's go ahead and talk about where this dude is located. If you guys take a look at the map, he is located in the very top left corner just north of Lake Isabella. As you guys can see, he is just on the north end. Essentially what you want to do is get on that track and stay as close to the lake as possible because the first clue is actually actually on a rock right next to the water. Once you're on that path, just take it towards the north end until it pops up and it says that you are in the area of a legendary animal. Like I said, the first clue, once you pop up, you're going to see the yellow dust is on a rock that is right there against the lake. Your first clue is against the rock that's near the lake and it's just a piece of fur. You want to go up, inspect that. Once you inspect that, your second clue is going to be on the giant rock right next to you. So if you guys look to your left, you'll see there's a giant rock next to some trees. The second clue will be on on top of that and it is dung. Then the third clue is on the other side of the giant rock so you want to keep going in the direction that you just went. You'll see it's very easy to find. It's basically a straight line of clues and that is broken sticks. Now once you inspect the broken sticks he will appear, he will spawn and most of the time he spawns up there in the trees. He'll just be walking around uh, I would recommend trying to get closer to him as you guys will see in the video I actually tried to get really close and make sure that he was looking at me so that I could get all headshots and not have to worry about him running getting lost in the trees or uh, or using the trees as cover so I tried to get as close as possible waited for him to look in my direction that's when I popped my dead eye and I started taking my shots like I said it took me six shots to take this dude out from the head uh, so if you have a rifle um, uh, you should be good to go I wouldn't recommend using anything else um, fairly easy to take down. I was watching some other videos of some guys that got in gunfights that were using snipers. And uh, if you hit him in the head with a sniper, I believe he has time to run away, but he'll fall down. And, uh, and he'll just be half dead laying on the ground. You won't have to track him that far. They're not very quick. They are huge, but they don't move extremely fast. Um, so you should be able to track them, no problem. But again, guys, six shots with the rifle to the head using dead eye. Fairly easy to take out. Absolute unit. Once you go and skin them, you'll be able to get your white bison pelt and do whatever you want with it. But anyway, guys, this is going to be how you kill, how you track the legendary white bison in Red Dead Redemption 2. If you guys have any questions, maybe you're having problems finding this guy or killing him, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below. Again, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see all you guys in the next video. Can we be